The heat-seeking sensor at the front sends a signal to the tracker, which then controls the missile's guidance system, steering it to the target. Its smart computer guarantees that the Javelin never loses life. And because Javelin doesn't rely on wire guidance systems or lasers to find its target, it has no known countermeasures. When the Javelin fires, there's nowhere to hide. And then we get to the target, and then all the exciting stuff happens. The Javelin can destroy any armor on the battlefield. It's so smart that with the flick of a switch, it can attack a tank at its weakest spot right here on the top. Anyone hiding inside? They're finished. Most tanks have a layer of explosive armor to destroy incoming missiles. It's called reactive armor, but the Javelin even has an answer for that. Two different explosives deal with the tank's defenses. First charge blows away the explosive armor. Reactive armor is actually explosive itself. Yes, it? exactly. The reactive armor is on the tank, and what happens is there's lots of explosive there that tries to destroy your weapon before the main warhead breaks through for the kill. So what we want to do is get those fly planes out of the way, right. clear the air, God. and then delay enough that we fire the main charge. It's clear, nothing but tank in front of it, and we put the warhead on the floor. In the blink of an eye, the inside of the tank reaches temperatures in excess of 8,000 degrees Fahrenheit. Nothing survives. But what if the target tries to hide down in the gully? Most shoulder fire missiles only operate along a line of sight, firing directly at the target. That's when the Javelin comes into its own. Javelin can switch from direct fire mode to top attack mode. The top attack mode is flying up at a much higher angle, coming down at a steeper angle and attacking the top of the tank. The top of the tank on the turret is where the thinnest armor is located. And that's where this place it penetrate through that thin armor. A lot of times with a top attack mode, what happens is it comes in at such an angle from the top. Mm -hmm. And basically the enemy thinks that you've got aircraft that are dropping bombs. But firing a missile is risky because it has a heat signature that immediately gives away the soldier's position, leaving them vulnerable to attack. By firing the javelin, is the soldier signing his own death warrant? 